Okay, now it's time to solve the classwork exercise together. So let's go back to the booklet here. The classwork sheet or task sheet here, it says fill in the following sentences with words in the boxes. In the boxes, we have some words and our job is to fill in the spaces with each one of them. Number one, the hut has shutters that open space and upwards to provide shade. Okay, how are we going to solve this? Outwards, exactly. It opens outwards and upwards. So this is the answer for number one. And let's highlight it with red to be clear. Number two, they have just returned from what places with wonderful stories to tell? Hmm. Far away. Exactly. Far away places, places that are not near. Okay. Number three, he doesn't paint for very long. Dots for two and a half hours at a time. Hmm. Perhaps, maybe, yes, perhaps. Okay. Number four, I hardly comprehend how television works. It's very, it's very what? It's not easy, it's complicated, exactly. So it's very complicated. Number five. For his dedication, dedication means that he does his best in his job. For his dedication, the mayor dots him a medal of merit. He gave it to him. What does it mean? Awarded. Exactly. He awarded him a medal. Number six, the earth, what around the sun? What does it do? Rotates. Yes. So the earth and the other planets, of course, they rotate around the sun. Number seven, the glass appears to what light naturally? Hmm. The glass appears to reflect light. Exactly. It reflects light. And the last one. When she first what me, I didn't recognize her voice. When she first contacted me. It was by phone, I suppose, because she's talking about voice here. Okay, let's move to exercise B. Write the antonyms. Nearby. Or neighboring, something nearby. What's the antonym of that? Far away. Exactly. Sink. What's the antonym of sink? F. Float. Unimportant. Something that is not important. The antonym, of course, is something important. So what is the word? Huh? Who can remember? It starts with N. Ness. Necessary, yes. Necessary, excellent. Let's move to four. Inwards. What's the antonym of inwards? Outwards. Great job. And the last one, simple or straightforward. When something is not simple, it's ca, ca complicated. Exactly. Okay. So now we finish the classwork exercise. Please do your homework exercise and we will check it when we meet at school. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much and see you soon. Bye.